The Teen Stepless Reduction Gearbox is designed to give great flexibility and reliability with low weight and silent operation, allowing the flexibility to fulfill a large variety of functions. Reduction ratios between 0 and 100% can be steplessly selected and therefore it can also act as a clutch mechanism. The Teen Stepless Reduction Gearbox works by controlling the flow of hydraulic oil within two helical chambers. The transmission of power operates both mechanically and hydraulically, adjusted by controlling the flow of oil from one chamber to the other, allowing stepless adjustment of reduction ratios between 0 and 100%. Components include input shaft, input helix, output drive discs, drive casing, hydraulic oil. The valve control mechanism consists of valve control unit, guide fork, actuator collar, fixing pin, valve control rod, valve actuator disc, valve port housing and hydraulic oil. Any desired reduction ratio between 0 and 100% can be set by sliding the valve control rod. Due to the screw form at its end, the valve control rod rotates the valve actuator disc, opening or closing the ports in the valve port housing, thus controlling or even completely stopping the flow of hydraulic oil. The spaces between the helical cylinders can be considered as chambers. When the oil flow ports are fully open, the flow of oil is unhindered, allowing the input helix to move transversely. When the oil ports are fully closed, the input helix is restricted from transverse action and forced to convert all of the force of the hydraulic oil into rotational torque. The input shaft turns the input helix, which is always held tightly against the output drive discs, giving its energy directly to these discs, and therefore to the output shaft. The transverse action of the input helix being restricted by the non-compressible hydraulic oil not being allowed to flow from one chamber to the other through the control valves is not transmitted, only the rotational component of this energy, i.e. there is no reduction taking place, there is 100% transmission of rotational torque and therefore a reduction ratio of 0%. Various combinations of transverse and rotational energy transfer can be steplessly set to differing openings of the valve pots leading to reduction ratios between 0 and 100%. With the actuator collar in the fully open setting, the oil flow between the two chambers is unrestricted, allowing the helix cylinder to move transversely along the input shaft, exerting no rotational force on the output drive discs. This results in zero torque transmission only the helix cylinder rotating and moving back and forth transversely along the input shaft, giving a reduction ratio of 100%. Sliding the actuator collar to a position halfway along the input shaft moves the valve actuator disc to the 50% setting, allowing the hydraulic oil to only flow at about half the speed and providing resistance to the transverse movement of the helix cylinder. This results in transmission of only half the torque to the output discs, a 50% reduction ratio. The adjustment collar can be easily repositioned along the input shaft, even during operation, allowing reduction ratios anywhere between 0 and 100%.